Well, if I, yeah, uh, 48 plus 20 plus 15 plus 89. Oh, that's even bigger. Okay. Does anybody see a cut whose capacity is 107? You think you do? Okay. C can, you, can you wave hands at it or... Tell me what's on the left side. Oh, okay. SEB? -E Just these? And everybody else is right? Okay. Does everybody see what he's saying? I, I don't know if it works yet, but let's check it. So he said, take these three. That's left. And everybody else is right. Now, what are the forward edges? E to D. B to G, and B to C, and S to C. So 63 plus 29, 92, plus 15, 107. Now, how do you find that? Answer, he's very clever, but he's incredibly lucky <laughs> that I'm using a network with uh, 10, 11, 12 nodes in it because this is like, at least at this level, this is like a Hamiltonian cycle problem. You're, I, I don't think you followed an algorithm, did you? You just did it by inspection. Okay, when we get back together on Tuesday, I'm going to teach you a systematic process for carrying out the location of augmenting paths. And when you cannot find any more augmenting paths, you will find the cut. It will be handed to you. And the current value of the flow will be the capacity of that cut. And then you go to the boss and you say, in your face. All right. Have a good weekend. I'll see you on Tuesday.